Hi guys, welcome to Cheap Sir Cuisine episode 1. Uh, my name is Ginger and today I am going to cook Marmite Spaghetti. Um, I was going to make pizza toast but apparently Tesco closes early on Sunday. So, you know, who knows. Um, so I'm going to make the same thing that I've been living on uh, for the last two weeks. Um, you might say it's not exactly the cheapest recipe ever because Marmite is quite expensive, but hey, it's Marmite. Um, right, so for that, um, you're going to need a pot, um, you're going to need a bowl, you're going to need a tablespoon, a fork, a knife, a teaspoon, and a saucepan, and of course, some spaghetti which is like 55p and marmite which is like 260 or whatever um right so the first thing you want to do is you want to boil some water um so turn this on uh, put it on high um pour some water into a pot Don't put too much water in because if it's gonna boil, it's gonna go over just a bit. Um, if you have salt, I don't have any salt, so yeah, if you have salt, put quite a bit of salt in it. Um, just really depends how salty you like food. Put that on so. And I am going to go and have a cigarette while that boils. I forgot one thing that you're gonna need. You're gonna need some butter. You're only gonna need a tiny little bit of butter, but you're gonna really need it. You're also gonna need something that tells time. Like, I have a watch, but it doesn't work, so I'm gonna use my phone instead. Or I could just use a laptop, really. But I didn't think of that, so. It's still not boiling. Okay, so the water's boiling now, and I know that because there's bubbles in it. Um, right, so what you're gonna need now, um, you need to take out of the packet enough spaghetti for yourself, or if you can make more people, some more, obviously. Um, well, I'm rather hungry, and this is like gonna be my only meal today, so I'm gonna take this much. Which is not really that much. It's just pasta. And you're gonna stick it into the pot with the boiling water. Like so. Yeah, that's in there. Um, now you need to wait for the pasta to boil a little bit. Um, because you don't want the ends to be tough and then the other end is to be really soft so you're gonna have to wait for that and when that's done just take a fork and just stick all of it in there right okay so all of the pasta is now in the water um so and yeah and only now to start counting the time so the time right now is 47 past this was for seven to eight minutes so I'm gonna check it again. I'm gonna book for seven. So and I need three minutes to make the sauce. So I'm gonna check it in four, so that's fifty-one. Alright. You might want to turn the heat up down a bit so that it doesn't overboil. But yeah, I'm gonna show you the pasta. It's in the pot. Yeah. Okay, back down with the microwave. Yeah, I put my laptop on the microwave. Great, so it's been four minutes, and now you're going to want to use the sauce bath. Um, so you're going to take the knife and the butter, and you're going to take a little bit of it. Well, no, depends really how many people you're cooking for. I'm cooking for one, and I'll show you how much I'm going to use. Yeah, it's good to take the butter out of the fridge as well. I took that much. It's a bit too much. 
creamy. But who cares? I like butter. And this is salted butter. So it's better than non salted butter. Oh, ew, I hate butter. Yeah, I mean, I like butter in food, but not like on my fingers. Right, and the knife. You're not gonna eat anymore. So stick on the There. Um, and wash your hand and put the butter back in the fridge because you're not gonna need it anymore. Now, this bit depends on how much you like marmite. Um, technically, you should only put half a teaspoon in it, but I fucking love marmite, so I'm gonna put a whole teaspoon because last time I used to have, it wasn't enough. Plus, I've got like a lot of butter now, so. No, no, God. You're not supposed to do that yet. Don't, don't put any marmite in just yet. Jesus. That was close. <laughs> uh, right, so you have your butter in the saucepan. Put that on the stove on low heat. Remember, low heat. High heat doesn't want to make it melt any quicker. It's just going to make it burn because I've tried that. Right, so the butter is melting and it's now technically the time to stop cooking the pasta. So, but what I'm going to do, I'm not going to take it off the fire. I'm going to take a fork and I'm going to take one strand out of it and try it. No, I'm gonna give it like 20 more seconds. Or so. Um, the butters have melted now. So, technically, you should be able to do that before you have to stop cooking the pasta. But in, I was explaining it to you guys, so I didn't do it. That's with me. Then take that into account, shoot to the next time. Um, oh, this isn't good. I just realized. All right, I'm gonna take the pasta off the stove, but I'm gonna leave it in the water, and you're gonna know why in a second. The butter, it's melted now. Oh, I can see that. I don't know what's spill it. Yeah, it's in there anyway. I'm gonna put it back in the stove now. And I'm going to take, like I said, I fucking love my mind. I'm gonna take a fucking entire teaspoon of Marmite, and I'm going to stick it in it. So. Yeah. Yep. I'm going to take this much Marmite, and I'm going to just put it in the butter. Now, my right doesn't want to come off the spoon too easily, so what I do, um, I put the stove on a little more heat now. Um, I turn it like that, and it just puts the spoon right into the butter. Together or something. Well, just take on one, basically. Right, so do that. Mm. I was just tasting the sauce. Which is basically nothing but butter and marmite. Mm. It's fucking amazing. And salty. Which is a good thing I didn't use any salt. Right, so now um take the tablespoon and take a tablespoon of the pasta water and stick it in the butter and the marmite. Now ready, and it's time to get the pasta out. And for that, you're gonna need a bowl, believe it or not. Um, now you're not gonna be able to see what I'm doing over there. I'm gonna need a little bit more. Um, yeah, it will work. Alright, 
And so this is a pasta. Spill as much of the water as you can out of it without spilling the pasta. And now that the pasta's coming out, I'm just going to take the ball, stick it on there. Just kind of press the pasta down to the bottom of the bowl. Ow! I just burned my head. Yeah, you, you want to be more careful of that. Come up. That's basically what you do. And just fill all the water out. Don't. Ow! I just did it again. Don't be too hasty when it comes to cooking. And then just put the pasta into the bowl. Not this. Oh, my it. I just got burned twice. I'm gonna mean cup. Stick them in there. Um, take this off up the stove. Eesh. Um, turn the heat off. Put it in there. Just into that pasta thing. Put some water into the saucepan because then it's time to clean it. Take a fork. Mix the pasta together with the marmite and the butter and everything. Tasty, 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 tasty. It's not gonna smell like marmite. That's the weirdest thing. Uh, it's gonna smell weird, but nice. And just mix that together. And Ah, I really burnt my hand this time. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Is it yummy? Oh, it's got a lot of butter in it. Uh. Mm. Yep, yeah, that is yummy. So, enjoy your dinner. Remember to wash your dishes or your flatmates. I'm gonna kill you.